uh, listen, I really don't like making videos back to back with what this one say, what that one said. All right, just did a, 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 a video about Crawford and Bob Arum. You know, I did make some mistakes in it because I'm, I'm trying to wrap it up because I got to go back to work. I got things to do. So I did say Arrow fighting Arrow. Like, pfft, like what the hell is wrong with me? You know, I'm trying to say Arrow fight Crawford. or And I, I messed up a couple of times. So just handle it and try to figure out what I say, you know. I, I do mess up sometimes because I'm rushing. I'm rushing. I got things to do, okay. But I did a back-to-back because -back I'm seeing Porter is, is getting at Crawford. I see Porter getting at... Spence about this welterweight and this and that. I'm like, oh god, this man. You know, listen, it's just, it's just, damn light. It's just him expressing that he's still relevant. He is still relevant. Come on, bro, he's relevant. The man's relevant. I understand that, but we're not thinking about you right now, okay? And I don't want you to be a distraction. Like, and I said with the one with unif um, unification with Crawford. Listen. The only way I can see this fight with Crawford and Porter, the only way, I don't see nothing with Spence, okay? Like I said in my other, my other video that I did a little bit of bloops and, you know, what, my, my, what I'm saying and shit. But the only way I can see Crawford fighting Porter if, is, is, wow, how do I see this? Uh, if Spence fights Pac, okay? I mean, like I said, he... he that's the only way, okay? But, like I said, stop bullshitting and, and putting this shit out about what did Crawford do. You know, I'm not a Crawford fan. And I'm not, and I'm, and I'm not really a Crawford fan. I like him. I like his style and everything. But uh, after, like I said, I see that performance with, with uh, Me Machine. It kind of just put a, a, a bad taste in my mouth. You know what I'm saying? And I saw some things. Yeah, you know, like Mikey saw some things. I saw some things that showed me that... Um, I don't think he could deal with Pacquiao, okay? Same thing with Spence with Porter. I saw some things in Spence. I don't think he'd deal with Pacquiao. But if Pacquiao and Spence fight, okay, that's his, yeah, Spence and Pacquiao fight and Crawford is out left in the win, well, you know, he has to defend his title, right? And if he doesn't fight Porter, you know, I'm bipolar with my shit sometimes. Get used to it, all right? But I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I don't want Porter in the middle of unification. That's what I was talking about in my other one with unification with Crawford and, and, and Bob Arum and his bullshit and why I think that it could happen and why I think it can't happen. But now I'm saying, listen, if Pacquiao fights Spence, Crawford is left in the win, right? Crawford, Crawford is left in the win. That would be a good fight. But like in my other video, I said, it's a risk. It's still a risk. Who would you rather see? Okay? I mean, would you rather see Crawford fight Spence? Right? For the unification? Or would you see, let's say Porter beats Crawford. Would you rather see Porter Spence too? Well, hey, anything can happen. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. But right now, I'm not hearing nothing going on, okay? This is the last week of January. We got 28 days left of February. I need to hear what's going on with Spence. Because right now, everybody's talking about what Spence did. What Spence, I'm not hearing nothing, okay? Training time is here, okay? The man is medically clear, like I said, right? Plus, he's in the, he's in the, he's in the gym. I mean, he's in the club exercising, okay? He's in the club exercising, Doing the ninja dances, okay? So let's just say he's, let's just say he's exercising in the gym. I'm mean, in the club. That's a, that's just let's just keep it like that, okay? Even though I, I I didn't approve of seeing that video after the whole situation what happened to him, you know. Let's just give the man a break. He's a young guy. Young guys, they they gotta, you know, they 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 go they go straight for it, okay? So after all that proof that he's cleared, because not just saying he's medically cleared, but he's in the club. That's more proof. That's more proof to say that this man is all right. I'm sorry. I don't want to hear this excuse about, well, he wasn't the same Errol Spence. No, I don't want to hear that. No, no, I don't want to hear that. Because a man said he's clear. The man said he wants Manny Pacquiao, Danny, or Bud Crawford. The man is in the club. 
kill it. I don't want to hear it no more, okay? So if something doesn't, for Spence fans, if something doesn't go right in the fight and your man loses to Crawford, I don't want to hear it, okay? Because guess what? Would you say that if Spence beat Crawford and, and, and it was the decision, would you say, well, I think Spence, if he was the, the Spence before the accident, I think he could have knocked out Crawford in the third or fourth round. They ain't going to say that. You know why? Because proof right there that that ain't going to happen. Because top welterweights is all debatable. All top welterweights are all debatable right now. Okay? Same thing with Danny Garcia and Porter. Same thing with uh, Keith Thurman. Okay? All these motherfuckers are debatable. They're not knocking each other out. They're not, not, they're not, you're not, you're, they're not, Jake, come on, man. All these fights are debatable, man. There is. There's a lot of people that think Porter lost to Spence. And there's some people that think Spence lost to Porter. Okay? Some people are just have it like this close if it wasn't for that knockdown. That half-ass knockdown that I could say. Because if you're going to knock somebody down, you know, knock them down. Okay? The man, you, you suppose, listen, you have an image that you have power. Okay? You got thumping power. Listen, that's what Chris Algeri said. He fought Spence and he fought Pacquiao. He said, Spence got that thumping power. Boom. That heavy thump power. And Pacquiao got that what? That boom. Surprise speed power. That makes you like, holy shit. You remember when Mosey hit the floor and he looked up and he was like, like, what the fuck happened? Yeah, that kind of power. Like he, And then when he got off, he said he still felt it. So... You know, if you if people saying you this and you that, you can't own up to it, and the, the 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 fight is debatable. Then, okay, it's debatable. Okay, there's a lot of fights against the top welterweights, and that's why I say Sean people Sean Sean Porter shouldn't say that about Smith. Talking about oh he's not a top welterweight. Yes he is. You didn't beat him. Uh, um, you didn't knock him out. You didn't beat him. You went to twelve rounds. You see what I'm saying? So the only thing about Sean Porter is. He's trying to stay relevant. That's his job, okay? Say this about Crawford. Say this about Spence. Keep the idea in their heads that he's still there, okay? That's all it is. And I got no problem with it. I got no problem with Porter opening his mouth saying this and that. The only problem I have is that, listen, we need unification. We don't need, we don't need distractions no more. I ain't trying to hear. Listen, who is the boss right now? Who is everybody waiting for? I would say Pac and then Spence. Those are the only two bosses. Crawford ain't got a, a, a pot to piss in on his decisions of what to do. He's with Bob Barron, okay? Okay, so if these two two fighters don't fight, Manny Pacquiao, for some odd reason, don't want to fight him and he wants to fight Danny Garcia, which I, 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 I that's a distraction too, okay? I don't know why he's doing that. Maybe he just, I don't know, and I, I don't agree with that. Okay, even though I'm a Manny Pacquiao fan, that's not on my agenda. My agenda is unification. I believe that Manny Pacquiao could go straight to Errol Spence, get those belts. If he wants to retire or he wants to fight Mayweather when this fool wanna come back, fine. But if he if he if 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 he beats Spence and he has three belts and Mayweather wants to continue fighting MMA fighters, well, if if you say you have the love of the sport and it's in you, and you got the eye of the tiger, and you still want to fight, well then, fight Crawford. You see how I am? You see how I am? I'm very bipolar, but but what I stand on is what I stand on, okay? Because I already said on the, in the other in the other one about I don't I don't see Porter fighting Crawford, but it's a possibility if Spence versus Pack, okay? Because I don't see why Crawford would fight another green machine. I mean, mean machine. I just don't see why. You know, you now it's you 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 making your fans and other people look at you like, uh, you see what's going on with Canelo, right? You want to fight somebody in Japan, um, some 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 boxer, what the fuck you want to fight? You think I care about that? Do you think I can, I want you to fight Charlo, okay? Uh uh uh, uh Boo Boo, you know, Andre, uh, 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 you know, I want to see fights that people that I know, okay? Think I care about? I never care about Canelo. I don't care two shits about Canelo. Okay, he got popped twice. Listen, let me tell you something. Mayweather put a whipping on Canelo, right? 
did put a whipping on Canelo. But guess what? If 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 Canelo didn't go up to 170 or whatever the fuck he is, his little little short little self, putting all that goddamn weight on. What is he? Five five, five six, something? You know what I'm saying? Putting all that goddamn weight on, man. You know what the biggest fight is before then Mayweather versus Pac? Pacquiao versus Canelo. When 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 why that fight never appeared to happen? Please, don't even tell me Canelo could beat Pacquiao. Please. Please. Okay? After Mayweather had beat um Canelo, right? Canelo could have got a couple of fights in and didn't fight Manny Pacquiao. Why didn't he want that monster? He didn't want that beast, man. He did not want that beast, yo. Okay? There ain't nothing Canelo could do to Pacquiao. I don't care what you say. Canelo could not beat Pacquiao. And that's the biggest, besides Mayweather, I think that's the biggest draw that would bring out a lot of people. Okay? On Cinco de Mayo, whatever. That fight could have happened. He didn't want that heat. He didn't want that pressure. So that's why I think Canelo, you know, I, I, I never, I, I, you know, Canelo, I don't want to talk about that man right now because he just irks the shit out of me. Big time. Okay? He's not fighting Charlo. He's not fighting, yeah, I know you say Charlo outbid himself and all this shit. Well, but what about Boo Boo? Or whatever, Andre. What about him? He's with his own. Or Golden Boy. Where the fuck they are, man? What about him? Where you gonna fight some, some, uh, another fucking Ush, Yush in fucking Japan? Explain that to me. Someone I don't know. So that's what he's gonna do for the rest of his, his career. Fight people that we don't want him to fight, the fans. And then be in the Hall of Fame, brother. You could never, never do what Manny Pacquiao did. Okay, you and fucking Lomo cannot do what Manny Pacquiao did. Same thing with Lomo. I got no beef with Lomo. I like Lomo. He's a southpaw. I'm a southpaw. Um, Spence is a southpaw. Oh, a Crawford's a southpaw. Okay, Tank is a southpaw. I like southpaws. Okay, I just love them. I love them to death. Okay, but if you ain't you ain't playing the part. Get the fuck out of my face, yo. All right? You ain't doing what you're supposed to do. If you a fighter, fight what I want to see, okay? I want to see. Don't stop fighting people that I don't know anymore. That shit is dead, man. You know, that shit is ridiculous. I'm getting tired of this shit. So listen, when it comes to unification, it's only three people I'm looking at right now, okay? That's it. Three people I'm looking at. And if it's Spence versus Pacquiao... Which I'm not hearing yet. I don't know what the problem is. Come on, Derek James and Al Heyman. What's going on? Is your is your fighter ready? Because out his mouth, he said he's ready. In the club, he's ready. Hmm? Yeah? Okay. So I don't want to hear no more, more 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 nonsense. Now, like I said, the proof is if Spence don't fight Pacquiao. Okay, and it depends who announces who's gonna fight who next. If Pacquiao denounces Garcia, yes, everybody gonna say Pac Duck Spence. But if Spence announces that he's gonna fight somebody before Pacquiao does, well, that's gonna be an argument too. That could be an argument too. Is it is it is it an argument of ducking after you said you wanted so and so? Are you gonna blame Pacquiao, which didn't announce his fight yet? Okay, only thing I'm looking for. From Manny Pacquiao, I don't give a fuck about Danny Garcia. I want you to fight Spence or Crawford. All right, if that could happen, okay? I think it's still a little possibility that could happen if you listen to my video I just made recently, okay? Just a couple hours ago, all right? But I, I'm just looking at three guys, three brothers, Spence, Manny Pacquiao, and Crawford. Whew, did I, did I say somebody named twice in this video like I did in the other? I'll be, you know, I'll be rushing, man. Sometimes I just, I'm always in a, in a rush and I'm, I'm just trying to get these videos out. And, you know, sometimes my mind be racing. I just pick the, the, pick the camera up and I try to get everything that I'm saying. Cause sometimes I'll be in a car and I'll just be, ah, and I'm like, God damn, why didn't I say that on video? And sometimes I just, I just make mess up. See, I'm new to this. You know, it's kind of hard, you know, you know, I'm new to this, but I'm, I'm, I'm getting into it, yo. All right. Just give me a chance, yo. If you don't like me, just just dislike me, you know, it's, it's okay, I understand it, you know, I'm from Brooklyn, hate, hate is something that's is common here, okay, all right, but to the Spence fans, to the Crawford fans, listen, I know everybody got agenda and want to say, why this one, want to fight this one, what have he done lately, 
and, and, and what did Crawford do at 147? He don't deserve the fight with Spence. I understand all that, but bro, it's three fighters with, with all the belts. Three fighters, okay? They all got belts. Let's concentrate on them and don't worry about Porter and Danny later, okay? Okay? Because the way I say see it, um, in the rankings, Danny wants to fight Porter for, 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 that, for, for what's going on on that side. If that if that happens, I did that too. I did a video about that too, okay. And and, and this interim shit, this interim shit with IBF that that IBF never do. But all of a sudden they doing an the interim because they said um, the champ ain't ready. In the meantime, well I'm hearing on this side of the neck, the champ saying he's ready, and then the actions of the IBF is saying no, he's not ready. All right. So after the announcement, 90 days come, let's see what happens. Or if there's no announcement of Pacquiao fighting Spence or Spence fighting Pacquiao or um, because I don't see how Spence is going to fight Abdul or Lipinitz because they're supposed to be eliminating each other to see who's going to fight um, Spence if, 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 if when Spence come back. So listen, I'm only going to go about what Spence said. Spence said he's ready. I don't care what the channels say. I don't care how y'all want to twist the, ch the, 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 the champion's words around because you feel like he's not ready. You you blaming yourself. You 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 telling on yourself. You telling on yourself. You know how you telling yourself? Because if the champ is, see, that's two next. The champ is saying over here, I'm ready. And the fans over here say, I don't know if he's ready. I don't know if he's ready. Listen, I also said it myself. But I also said that, listen, Spence needs a tune-up. Spence needs to fight someone. I need to see where he's at. I want to see the dog in him. But guess what? After time goes by and he says, I don't want no tune-up. Why should I keep pushing that agenda? Then he's in the club. Why am I going to push that agenda that he needs a tune-up? Okay? He said he's still got the, the dog in him. Right? Ain't nothing changed. He's out there working out. Right? Derek J said he wants to see how he's doing sparring, the mitts, all that, if he's the same person. So what's the, what's going on now? Because time is going. Time is going by quickly. Time is going by quickly. After this week, February, it's going to start. Got 28 days. Something got to be announced by February because Manny Pacquiao is coming back in April. Okay? So most likely it's, it's, it's either if, if Spence really want this fight, Spence and Manny Pacquiao will have to make an agreement around April, May, June. Around around May or June or April. One of those three months, okay, if they agree to fight, okay? Cause and 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 that's the way it goes. I, I'm pretty sure Spence's not gonna come back in April or March. Maybe he said, like he said, I'm only going by what he said, May or June. Okay? Same thing. So if if there's if there's some kind of um, problem where Pacquiao got to do his senior, duty, senior duties. See, I'm messing up. I'm messing up. I'm waiting for somebody. I know they're coming any minute now. So I'm, my mind is like, I'm trying to get all I can. If he got senior duties in May or in, in June and there's an issue, well, if Spence really want to fight, he could make it in March and April. Okay? If he really wants to fight. If he say he is who he is, come on, this is the beginning of the year. Let's get it popping. Let's get this shit shaking and baking. Shake, let's shake and bake, nigga. What's the problem? Both of y'all, what's the problem? Let's get this shit shake. Let's get this shit moving, okay? So if there's no problem on your side, Spence, and you saying that right here, and then the IBF is doing another thing because they feel like you're not ready, or there's something creeping up in somebody. Listen, all I care about is unification. I'm gonna care. I'm gonna care two shits about Crawford numbers, who he fought at 147. I don't care about Spence and and and, and, and anything else. Spence said he's ready. Okay, medically clear in the club, shaking and baking. I want to see that fight. I don't got no other reasons to hear what no other channels got to say or what other fans saying. Well, yeah, I don't think he's ready. Man, look, my peoples are here. I got to go. Yeah.